Welcome to the Chris Harold Show, where we help coaches, consultants, and experts go from overworked, overwhelmed, and underperforming to enjoying a full sales pipeline and more revenue in order to fulfill your kingdom assignment and create an eternal legacy using our God's Masterpiece Rapid Success System. Welcome your host, Christopher Harold. Hey, hey, what's going on, my friend? Hey, Christopher Harold here, the Kingdom Marketing Superman. And right now I'm live on location. Actually, uh, I'm outside my kid's dental office. <laughs> They're uh, inside this dentist's office here behind me. You see, I don't know if you can see it, but you may see a little bit. Yeah, but outside this dental office. So I say, you know, let me pop on and do the next episode in the Chris Harold Show. So, uh, so I'm excited that you're here, my friend. It's your first time checking me out. You're in for a good treat. You made the right place. This is for uh, kingdom-minded coaches, consultants, and experts who are looking to create an eternal legacy in their business. And so uh, I'm really excited to share this episode with you because I think it's going hit, to be hit near and dear to home for you. So really quick, uh, before I do that, I want to give a really quick PSA public service announcement aka a commercial if you are a coach consultant and an expert an entrepreneur you are currently selling online and you want to be able to stand out from the competition you want to be able to uh really go to the next level in your life and business you know you want to be able to uh grow your brand you want to get more clients in a in a, in a, in a fast and predictable way you want to be able to uh leave a legacy Right? You want to be able to get more authority, more credibility. I want to invite you to a very special masterclass I'm hosting that's going to show you how to do this by leveraging a book. Uh, by leveraging a book. Now, this is not about writing a book. None of, that, none of that stuff didn't take a whole year or two. This is about creating a book, a really good book, in about 90 minutes or less that will get you more buyers for your business, that will help you grow and scale your business. The masterclass is called How to Create sell and scale your business fast with a book and this is only for coaches consultants and experts and entrepreneurs who are currently selling online and you want to grow your business in a fast and predictable way if that's you simply there should be a link somewhere around this video you might see a banner on the screen simply go to uh chrissherald.com forward slash book webinar chrissherald.com forward slash book webinar or click the link somewhere that you see around this video we got a brand new class starting any day now you do not want to miss this so go and get your spot asap all right so let's talk about what i'm gonna talk about in this topic today which is quite simply how to discover your purpose now i was gonna call this uh are you in alignment with your assignment but how to discover your purpose will probably get more attention because why everybody wants to discover their purpose, right? Everyone wants to know, okay, what is what is uh, what is my purpose in life, right? Um, what you know, why am I here on this planet? Like, uh, you know, I may get out and walk because get tired of sitting sometime. But like, why am I here on this planet? What what am I supposed to be doing? You know, with my life, um, basically. I want to help you because here's the deal. You will not be able to create more impact that you put on this planet to create. You will not be able to do all the things that God wants you to do on this planet until you discover this, until you discover your purpose, right? I mean, if we if we were to do a survey, and I used to be one of these people, but if we were to go out and survey the masses, literally go out and survey the masses, we would discover that the majority of people the overwhelming majority of people on this planet have no idea why they're here. They have no idea why, why they're here. They, they, they're here just to exist. They're here just to, I'm going to get out and walk a little bit. They're here just to uh, suck up oxygen, you're right? They're here just to suck up space, right? And I'm, I want to tell you that God did not create you for that. God did not create you just to come here to suck up oxygen, to, to suck up space. He created you with, 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 with a purpose in mind for you to, you were put on this planet to solve a problem for others, okay? You were not put on this planet for any other reason but to solve the problems of others. And 
and you are supposed to contribute to the good of society each one of us is supposed to contribute to the good of society so we're supposed to leave this place this planet when, when our time is done here on this side we're supposed to leave this place a lot better than how we found it right and so if the key is the first and foremost discovering your assignment right and so the question is are you in alignment with your assignment but, but here are some clues because one of the most challenging things you might have is how to find your purpose right how to find your assignment how how to discover like why am i here why did god create me right and so uh let me share with you some tips that'll help you go out and discover your purpose and discover your assignment um a lot of times is that you can figure out what you're going to do because ask trust me i know personally i've been I, I was miserable for years um I was miserable for years to the point where I wanted to commit suicide because why I was not walking in my assignment. I was not doing the thing that God told me to do on this planet. I was not, you know, I didn't know I was following the norm. I was doing what everybody, everybody you know, if, if you follow the norm, if you follow the system that everybody else tells you to follow, you're not going to be able to do the things that, that you're supposed to be doing. So, so uh, I was miserable. I mean, you know, I wanted to take myself out because I was not walking in my purpose and assignment, okay? So, how can we find our purpose and assignment? Well, great, great question. First thing you wanna, do, you wanna check is your passion. A lot of times, and most of the times, what God puts you to do is gonna be something that you have a, a passion about. Now, it does not mean that, that, that you will be highly skilled in that area, but it means that you will have a passion, like, my background, shucks, I got fired from 15 different jobs. Why? Because nothing I ever did, I was good in most of those jobs. Very good. But I was never passionate about it. Right? When you're passionate about something, it's no longer work. It's like, you ever heard, you heard the saying, like, what's the one thing you would do for free? That's a good indication that that's part of your assignment. And everybody's going to be different. What I'm passionate about, other folks may not be passionate about. What I enjoy, other folks might not enjoy, right? But, but, but what I'm telling you is that it will begin to line up with your passion. Because a lot of times your purpose is, is, is connected to your passion. What's, what's the one thing that you think about all the time? What's the one thing that when you go around other people, it's like, People are like, man, you always, you know, can help me in this area. Or it's like, like, what's the one thing that you know you can solve problems for for a lot of people, right? See, all this are clues of, of uh, your giftings. All these are clues of discovering your purpose on this planet. Because I'm going to say this too. We, we can go out and be successful in a lot of ventures in life. But if, we, if we're not doing the very thing that God put us on this planet to do, we're failures. Let me give you an example. If I decided to go and be a big time drug dealer, right? And go out and make millions of dollars, right? I have a lot of money. And according to a lot of people in the world, having a lot of money means you're successful. But the way I did it makes me a failure. Why? Because I broke the law. Same thing for those in the porn industry, right? You can go out and make millions of dollars in the porn industry. Yet, you are a failure because why? You broke God's law, moral law, and man's law, really. You, you broke the law, right? You broke laws. You did something immoral to do it. So you can have a lot of money. That doesn't necessarily mean that you're, that you're successful. You can leave this planet when you die and still be a failure. So you want to make sure that what you're doing not only benefits others, right? But it also doesn't break laws, right? It doesn't violate laws, man's law as well as God's law. Because if it does, I can promise you that's not your purpose. You were not sent here to do that. So, um, so you wanna you wanna ask yourself, like, you know, here's the here's the thing I'm gonna say this too. A lot of folks say, find your purpose. And this guy's sitting there recording. He's gonna turn that loud thing on over there. Some people is rude. His purpose is to be rude. 
But let me move over here. This guy's so being so rude. Like he don't see me recording. Help me, Lord. All right. But here's the deal. Um, I forgot what I was going to say. I'm going to come back. But what I was saying was this. You want to make sure that everything you do is in alignment with your assignment, right? Uh, every yes you make has to be in alignment with your assignment. It's like, oh, here's what I'm going to say. You don't really find your purpose. Like, uh, you know, I, I titled it How to Find Your Purpose. You don't really find your purpose. You discover it because it's already in you. You know, it's, it's like it's already in you. Why? Because God put that in you the moment you were conceived and the moment you was birthed on this planet. So it was already in you, okay? The challenge that people have and the challenge that, that most people have and the challenge that you might have is simply discovering that, right? It's simply bringing it out. But one, but one clue, as I share with you, a major clue is what I just shared with you. What are you passionate about? Also, like, what, what is something that drives you? You know, what, what is something that keeps you up at night? Also, what are things that may anger you? Move this stuff over here. What are things that might anger you, right? What are some things that anger you? And and, and you're like, well, shucks, man. Uh, that makes me mad. I get upset. Well, whatever truly gets you upset, most likely is in alignment with your assignment, right? If 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 you if you see some things that are happening in the world, and and, and it makes your blood boil. That's a good indication that you would put her to help solve that problem. See, here's the deal. Everyone's a problem solver. The, the, the sad fact is 97% of society don't know it. Because we have not been taught how to solve problems. We have not been taught how to find out, you know, how, how to get our purpose realized. We've been taught to follow a system. We've been taught to go to school, get a traditional education, go work a job for 40 40. 50 years, retire in your mid-60s, and then enjoy life. And most of society follow that system like sheep. But never have they been taught to find their purpose. Never have they been taught to find their true work. Never have they been taught to, to find their identity on why they're here on this planet. And that's scary because most people leave here not ever accomplishing the thing they were brought here to do. And I'm I don't want you to have that same fate, my friend. That's why I'm sharing this information with you right now. And again, if you're just tuning in right now, if you're a coach, consultant, expert, an entrepreneur who, are, who is currently selling online and you want more clients, you want more exposure, you want to grow your brand, you want more authority, more credibility, you want to stand out from the competition and begin to leave a legacy. I'm putting together a free mass class that's going to show you how to create, sell, and scale your business fast with a book. And uh, uh, hey, hey, how you doing? And, and literally, when I created my books, everything radically shifted for me in my business. And I, t I can tell you this, less, less than 1% of people in your industry have created a book. And I'm, talk, I'm not talking about writing some love story novel, some mystery novel, none of that stuff. It takes you a year or two to do. No, we don't have time for that. This is by creating a really good book in 90 minutes or less. That's something that, that people will want to buy and get you more buyers in your business. If that is you and you want more buyers, want more clients, you want more growth, Go join my free master class right now by clicking the link around this video or simply going to chrisherald.com forward slash book webinar, chrisherald.com forward slash B-O-O-K-W-E-B-I-N-A-R. All right. You want to join this free master class? It's going to, I guarantee you, this master class is going to be better than programs you paid two, three, four, five thousand dollars $5,000 for it easily. I've been told that already. So go check it out. Now, before I conclude, my friend, I just want to encourage you to say, listen, God said, I know the plans I have for you, the plans to prosper you and not, and not to do you harm. Uh, so God wants you to prosper and succeed. God takes the light when you prosper and succeed. And, 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 and it's his will for you to prosper and succeed. But for that to happen, you got to discover your purpose and assignment. And then you want to make sure that everything you do is in alignment with that assignment. Okay. You want to make sure everything you do is always in alignment with that assignment. So, uh, check your passions. Check the things that make you angry. 
check the things that that that, that you think about 24 7 right and begin to develop that area once you find that now you have to do the next work which is becoming highly skilled in that area which is invested in coaching and training and mentoring right and education to to grow it and develop it and nurture it to become highly skilled and then once you do that you begin to find your purpose live out your purpose and prosper in your purpose so any questions my friend let me know if this helped you out please let me know as well i hope you enjoyed this episode and and and, and again my friend remember this put god first in all that you do and you too shall succeed and uh before you go make sure you check this out now the fastest way for you to grow your business is with a book so if you want more authority more credibility more opportunities more exposure more clients and more income i want to invite you to a free master class that i'm hosting that'll show you the fastest way to create authority and credibility seemingly overnight with a book without being a guru spending a lot of money and hiring third-party companies Hey, I'm Chris Harrell, and I'm an online entrepreneur just like you. And for years, I struggled with growing my business, being seen as an authority, and getting my message out to the world. Listen, I tried every internet marketing method out there, known to man, but it still left me stuck, busted, and disgusted until a mentor of mine inspired me to write a book. And the crazy thing is, I always wanted to do so, but I never knew exactly how, or had the blueprint to do it fast, and why being a husband, father of three, a mentor, coach, consultant, and also involved in community organizations. But when I finally published my book, Kingdom Affirmations, a whole new world opened to me and my business boomed to multiple six figures in only 90 days. Now I help entrepreneurs online go from overworked, overwhelmed, and underperforming to enjoying a full sales pipeline and more revenue while creating an eternal legacy. And you know how to create and leave a legacy that actually will outlive you? is by creating selling and scaling your business with a book and in my free master class you're going to discover how to create a really good book without even writing a word or hiring a ghostwriter how to sell your book consistently even if you hate or even suck at selling how to make more money with a free book than those who sell theirs for twenty dollars thirty dollars or even forty dollars in fact this is a snapshot of the sales from my free book is generated as side passive income in less than a year again this is from a free book now i teach you how to do this in a master class you'll discover what people really buy when they get your book and how to sell it to them what to do exactly one hour after someone buys your book now hint this is what a real money is and a whole lot more now this is for you even if you've never written a book or if you have and you want to sell more and scale your business to new heights now while the master class is free it is on a first come first serve basis because the software that we use for the live master class it only holds 500 seats. And once all the seats are filled, the seats are gone. So I highly recommend you go ahead and get your seat now by click, clicking the link somewhere you see around this video now. So if you wanna get your message out, grow your brand, create more impact, get more clients, or leave a legacy, get your seat now, and I can't wait to see you inside the masterclass. God bless. Oh yeah, one more thing. I just wrote and published a brand new book that took only three days from conception to physical book in hand to do and it only took me 15 minutes to create i'm gonna show you how to do this also inside the master class this right here is a game changer so go ahead and get your seat right now thanks for listening to the chris harold show for more powerful resources to grow your business fast the kingdom way Go to chrisherald.com forward slash three keys to success or click the link in the show notes. If this podcast has impacted you, we ask you to subscribe, post a review and share it with a friend.